hello welcome to town missy prizzy borders here i have an empties video um that i want to share with y'all i've been saving these empties for a while and i just wanted to go ahead and i don't have meaning but i have some and i wanted to share them with y'all so i could finally throw these balls away i'm gonna start with my most favorite favorite things this is an empties video will i repurchase some yes some no um this bottle right here and this bottle right here i'm draining these draining them actually i don't know how much more i can get out of these i bought these at first time i ever bought it well the second time too I ever bought or maybe third anyways when i ever ever when i've ever bought these i've been able to get them at tj maxx they're no poor blum primer poor p-o-r-e um these are the best primers for my skin um this has been a repurchase over and over and over since i started using these or uh, this one is just one but I got two <laughs> that I'm draining the bottles of. Um, I'm keeping the bottles till I get me some more. You can actually get that at Ulta. And I don't know if the bottle is bigger at Ulta than it was at TJ Maxx. But regardless of the fact, that's the best primer, hands down, that I have found that's affordable. Um, the bottle at TJ Maxx, I think, is around... I want to say eight or ten dollars. I'm not. I'm not quite sure. It might have been ten. I'm sure if you looked at my past videos where I did a haul and I got that, then I'd probably tell you what price it was. However, I'm going to get me some more because, and sometimes, even if I'm not wearing makeup, I put that on. I use it as. Um, it's don't say that it is a moisturizer, but I just love the way it feels on my skin. I love the way it makes my face look. I don't have um, much of anything there. I got on some blush, some gloss, and some mascara. And that's it. Oh, and some powder. Powder. Yeah. Not heavy powder, just Kosa powder. And I love it too. So, anyways, before I yank, rattle on about everything else under the sun except for my empties, let's get started. Um, my hairdresser got this for me. Total results. And it is a purple shampoo. I've been saving it for a while. Can you tell? Um, I did finish it. Let me smell of it. Okay, obviously that's not the way to go. Okay, well, so we can't smell of it. It don't stink, but it don't... I don't like purple shampoo. You know, but it is important to use some. But I will not repurchase this. Will not. It's not a repurchase for me. Nothing wrong with it. Um... I don't know why I don't like purple shampoo. I have recently purchased some, but I, and I haven't used it yet. Um, I don't know why I don't like it. I mean, I'm a weirdo. Anyways, regardless of that, I will not repurchase that kind. I'll just try them all purple shampoos until I can get the right one that I feel like is right for me. This shampoo right here is so fabulous. I even got, now I have a big container of this with a little pump on there. I should probably save this bottle to, I could refill it, you know, because it's easier to put in the shower. But it smells like fruity bananas. I love the shampoo and I also have the conditioner in this. I love it. it smells so, so good. It's, it makes my hair just, mm, I, I love it. It does wonders for my hair. Although... Right now, I feel like I'm trying to come up with something to make my hair less frizzy. I use this crack mist. I'm not finished with it. It's crack hairspray fix is what it is. But I use that to cut down on my frizz. I also use, this is not empty, I'm just, I'm just sharing a little bit more. However, this is almost empty and it's 11, I bought it who knows how long ago at TJ Maxx for $11.99 and it's called Chia Iron Guard. I put that on my hair every time I wash it too. Although I don't wash my hair every day. I just don't. Okay, so back to the empties before I get too distracted. This first was the first herbal essence I ever used and it's rose, rose hip 
rose hips shampoo cleared the bottle you know this is so good i love i didn't know i loved herbal essence as much as i do but i like to switch my shampoos up you know and wear my shampoos <laughs> not wearing my shampoos i'm just all over the place and i'm sorry i brought this in here too to show you that i had this um the rose hips conditioner as well um i still have a little bit in there but I have started on the um, newest, um, the newest herbal essence I got. Whole video coming soon to you. Just green near you. Um, anyway, so I feel like I'm silly tonight. I'm sorry. Forgive me. But anyways, this herbal essence, I found out that I just love herbal essence. And sometimes I use high-end herbal essence. High-end drugstore. High-end drugs you know whatever like that i just like to rotate it i don't like to use the same thing all the time now this was i use um bath and body all the time when i'm in the shower yeah when i'm in the shower because it don't rip my skin out um it don't leave me with hives it don't itch me it don't leave my my skin ain't dry with it you know and this was one that I had purchased when it was like near to nothing on like a whatever sale. You know, SAS, I guess. This was candied uh, violet sorbet. Used it to the last drop. I think I got a little bit left in there. But anyways, I will repurchase all Bath and Body Works scents that call my name or that I like. I really like um cake, coconut, fruity, all that good stuff. I want to smell a walk I want to smell like a walking cupcake to be honest with you. Um this I absolutely love this dry shampoo. It's from Pantene. Never tell dry shampoo. It don't leave a white cast in your hair. It just I just love it really. I mean this has been a repurchase over and over and over. It's wonderful. Um, I don't have a, this is not going to be a long, a long video, um, if you were expecting that. Um, this is Confetti Cake Pop. For a long time, and I'm draining that because I want to get every single last drop of Confetti Cake Pop. Because it smells that good. Um, but for a long time, I didn't know that they still made that because it, they changed the, the package, but they do still make that. So... I will get me some more. Now, I don't think I ever had... Yes, I had. Yes, I did have the shower gel too, but my shower gels don't seem to last as long as my body lotions and my sprays and all that stuff. You know, I still got the Confetti Cake Pop um, body spray. That's the last of the lotion. Anyway, carry on. This right here is one of the lotions that I can wear on my skin that does not break me out knives it smells fabulous and i have i have scraped it dry i keep it around though so i won't forget to repurchase it i don't want to forget because it's not something that i use every single day i just use it when i feel like being bougie to be honest with you oh and i got the spray too it smells so I've repurchased the spray more than once. I'll share that with you next time. Um, this right here, this Coco Cabana, um, this was moisturizing body cream. Oh, wait a minute. It says cleanser. Never mind. It's soap. I didn't really like this smell as, as much. I mean, I think I purchased that in like a little mini um, thing because I thought it would be like the closest version of something from bath and body works i still got lotion in this one it's not my favorite this right here is spectacular this is smells so good this smells mm, it's okay i mean it's it's okay it's not my favorite if i'm gonna get a good coconutty scent i'm gonna go with bath and body works 
And if I'm going to get something that just makes me feel fabulous and bougie, I'm going to get this. That's just my personal opinion. And trust me, I got one just like everybody else. I keep smelling that, but it almost has a... It's got coconut smell, but... It almost smells like it's got another smell in there, too, with it. And I just don't like it. That's just my personal opinion. You know, I'm just sharing. But I keep that around for comparisons. Because I just don't like it. I said that like three times in. I must be tired, y'all. Who knows? Um, this is my short and sweet video. I don't think I've ever made a video under 30 minutes. So, if you're watching this and you like them short videos, congratulations. I made this for you. Um, no, this is it for me. I'm going to have to get ready for tomorrow. Tomorrow's Monday. I'm going to get ready and I'm going to be awesome. God's going to help me be awesome tomorrow. Um, and it, or just remember, if you're going out in public tomorrow and someone don't have a smile, you give them yours because you are special. Well, no matter what anybody tells you, you are beautiful. Yeah, I'm talking to you, the one that's looking at this screen right now you. If you're watching this, leave me a comment. I love you so much. Talk to you soon. Bye.